Well guys, good afternoon. Uh, it's already summer. There's no more school, so kids are out. So um, this is when we take advantage of the time to really go through these units. Uh, we bring them in the shop, tear them apart. I mean, pull tires, pull brakes, drums, check everything, slack adjust everything. And uh, we just make sure that everything is okay. Whatever needs to be replaced, well, this is when we do it. So uh, this is a, a PM care, but it's like, it's not an A, so I'm gonna say it's a C. Uh, we have a list we actually use and we have to check up on uh, measure brake shoe thicknesses, uh, play on the push rod on the, I mean, basically we check everything. So let me show you guys, uh, I already started this one up. Uh, uh, let me show you what I gotta do or the things we actually do to get these units back up and running. Well, as you guys can see, uh, I already pulled the drum off of this side. Uh, brake shoes, they're, they've been replaced in the past uh, and look very, fairly new. So does a brake chamber. So this has been worked on in the past. Uh, I didn't go back and check to see when was the last time we worked on it or when the brakes were replaced, but we still have to tear them apart, deglaze a brake shoe, deglaze a brake drum, and uh, basically check tri tire tread depth. And uh, what they got to replace? Well, this is when we do it. Make sure the leaf springs are not broken, so on and so forth. Basically, it's a, a pre trip plus, but. <laughs> Let me show you guys the tires. Well guys, on the right side of the axle, we weren't that lucky. Uh, this has got a uh, hub seal is leaking. Brake shoes are saturated in oil, so because of this, we are gonna have to do brake shoes on both sides. And uh, I'm gonna try and see if I can salvage those drums. The drums haven't been worn at all, so I'm just gonna deglaze and clean them and use the same drums, but these shoes are gonna be replaced on both sides. Like I said, I mean, the brake shoe is actually new, but it is saturated in oil. Bottom one is, so these little surprises that we don't catch while they're actually driving, I mean, right now that's the reason why we tear these apart. Uh, we want to actually find these things and correct them before we send them out to start the new year. So I'm going to have to get some work done to this one. Well guys, uh, we went ahead and got these uh, Silverback 4707 brake shoes, they're 20,000 pounds. Let, let me go ahead and get these ready for assembly. The, these are the two pins that you have to actually hammer in there. The rest are all spring, so it's spring loaded. So let me get these on there real quick. Uh, you see these holes right here? This is, you kind of just fit it through and then one sharp blow. Ah, didn't get it on that one, guys, but there's one. And there's two. Well guys, when you put the tires on, make sure that the outside wheel, the valve stem is on this side. And as you can see, there's another port on that wheel on this side. The valve stem for the inner tire is actually on this side. That way you can go ahead and air this one up or this one without having to deal with both on the same side or it being covered. 
And that's, that's it for this side. Now I gotta go to the other side. The other side I'm gonna have to replace that seal. I didn't do the seal on this side because I checked on the paperwork and this one, the reason they replaced the brakes was because it's saturated on this side. The guys only did one side of the bus instead of, instead of doing both. So since this one is only like three months old, I'm gonna go ahead and leave it at that and just go ahead and re replace the seal on the other hub. I guess let me get to that one. Well guys, now I'm going to go ahead and remove that uh, nut that holds the nut, the hub in place and break off that hub off of the differential so I can go ahead and clean it up and replace the seal on it. Well guys, uh, we're going to go ahead and stop it here, it's already going to be 4 so I'll just go ahead and call it quits for the day and we'll just uh, start on this one back up on it tomorrow. Uh, like I said, I mean we go through the buses, we go through everything, belts, oil, tires, brakes, I mean a little of everything, ACs and stuff like that so I'll go ahead and uh, start where I left off tomorrow which is here finish this off and then continue going through the bus see what else we can find on this one and hopefully tomorrow we'll be able to finish this off and go ahead and put it put it back up and bring in the next one so it's going to be repetition from now on all summer i mean bring buses in i'm pretty sure we're all we're going to find issues with all the buses going from minor all the way to major i consider this one to be i'm going to say from one to ten this would be like a maybe a five going to six so i'm pretty sure we'll find something better down the line all right guys well thanks for watching guys